through doing some Facebook campaigns. Maybe, how many of you guys are actually posting on, how many of you guys have a fan page on Facebook? I know a couple days ago we were like, screw Facebook! And I'm like, ooh, yeah, but no. <laughs> yeah, but no. My conscience was saying, no. My subconscious was saying, yeah. Because I make a lot of money on Facebook. Right? I'll be on Facebook. But there's a strategy to Facebook. If you go on Facebook and you post, you should join my team because of this, and if you don't, we punch wizards in the face. <laughs> Only we understand that language. That's, that's our little secret. Right? The people out there have no idea what the hell you're even talking about and why you're talking to them so abrasively. But here's a cool little thing, real fast, real fast. You want a quick Facebook training? Yeah. Quick, quick, quick. You gotta have a fan page though. Don't ask me, do I gotta have a fan page? Yes, you have to have a fan page for this to work. If you don't have one, start one, create one, do whatever you gotta do. I'm not gonna teach you on how to start a fan page, just get one, okay? When you get one, you have to post on it. You gotta acquire some fans and stuff, right? And you start, this is how I built my fan page in the very beginning. I just went to my profile. How many of you guys have a, a Facebook profile? Does anybody have any friends on their Facebook profile? And what I did was initially, without Facebook, PPC, and all this, initially I just went to my profile and I said, hey everybody, I'm starting a fan page. I'd love for you to click like. I'll be sharing some tips on marketing and some inspirational stuff. Would love your feedback. Right? And then all of your friends, existing friends, go over and they what? Like. So you can get a few like that. Right? But here's the strategy. The strategy is you have a blog post because you're blogging daily. And you're going to use that badass content link. And then you're going to post it on your fan page, but you have got to have an image in that post. Do you hear me? Yes. Don't write these boring dead behind posts. Where people, people are visual, guys. You are marketers. Why do you think television is television? Because they want to appeal to the, to the visual aspect of, of people and the, what, how they can convey messages to them so that they go out and buy. It's visual. Have a, a good picture up there, something indicative of your post, creative. And then when you, when you import that post into the Facebook page, that photo will show up, right? Then, after you post, there's a little thing now in the bottom right-hand corner, and it says what? Boost post. You click that. And there's gonna be some numbers that pop up with a little dollar sign on the side. It's gonna cost. Not trying to elude you in this. Five dollars? $10, 15 20 $25? It really depends on your reach right now, how many fans you have right now. So if you don't have a huge, huge, huge fan base, your cost to boost the post is gonna start at $5. And it will tell you how many more people you should expect to see the post based on that $5 payment. You can choose 10, right, you can do that. And then what you do is you select the payment, and you allow it to go, and you go do something else. That's what you do. That's the Facebook strategy. It ain't that hard, and that because it's not scientific, some of you guys ain't gonna do it. Because you're waiting for the secret, like I'm Mark Zuckerberg or something. I don't know. I'm just telling you how to make the money on Facebook. I didn't create Facebook, right? Just do it. So you do that enough, if you're smart, if you're smart, you have a call to action in your blog post, don't you? Yeah. If you're smart, and then couldn't you generate leads from doing that? Yeah. Because you are blogging, you posted the blog on Facebook, you boosted the post, people are seeing it, they're clicking, it's nice, it's short, it's to the point, it's graphical, it's visual, and you have a nice, wonderful, inviting call to action, and they click, and where do you send